Hi me. Hi me. Main ones take. Today on Main Ones Take, I'd like to take a second of your time to discuss a very important topic in today's society. And what am I talking about? Safety, of course. What kind of safety? Child safety. What kind of child safety? Sports child safety. But where? At home. It is very important that you keep an eye on your child at all times whenever they're touching rubber air chambers made of rubber. It can be very dangerous if they don't know what they're doing and they don't use the right protocols whenever they're trying to play their favorite athletic game. For all you parents out there, I'm going to ask you a couple of questions. And this will determine how well you are keeping your child safe whenever you let them outside to go a cricket ball, or play balancesto, or maybe even just go outside and kick a can. You need to be aware of what you're doing, and are you doing it right, or are you doing it wrong, and how you can improve the way that you go about letting your child play sports by themselves outside. Do you know what this is? This is a standard issued Japanese gangster bat. That's right, this is not an innocent looking baseball bat that your child tries to tell you it is. No, this is used in turf wars and gangster related activities. Now, I bet you weren't aware that when you let your kids outside to go play with the neighborhood children, they're actually fighting over turf. Your child's been deceiving you all this time. You need to get it together. You need to take this away from them if you have one or they have one because this is unacceptable as a parent and as a mother of two myself. I would never let any, either one of my dogs play with these. It's unacceptable. You can't. You cannot let them have this. You need to get it together. Next item! Now, the next thing I'm about to show you may be disturbing to some viewers, so if you have an uneasy stomach, you might want to look away. You're going to break this table, don't you? Do you know what this is? A basketball, I bet you say. Any person who is not in the know would say that this is a harmless basketball. This is actually, little did you know, you see that little hole right there? This is where the kids store their cocaine these days. This is a drug storage device. Yeah, you think your kids out there having a great time playing basketball, dunking on the other kids in the hood? No, it's not. This is a cocaine smoking slash storage device. How do they smoke it out of this? Well, it's simple. They take this hole, they stick it up to their nostril, and they snort it. That's how they get the cocaine out of it. This is not okay. You shouldn't let your kids have one of these either. This is even worse than the Japanese bat. Okay? This is unacceptable. If you are a parent who allows one of your kids to have these, shame on you. You physically disgust me. Next item! Most of you may be wondering, hey, what is this thing? Why, how and why would my kids want to use one of these as a toy? They do. You go and you buy your kids these little miniature shovels and you think, ah, oh, that's cute. They're digging a hole in my arm. They're going to fill it back up afterwards. No harm will be done. That's a lie. Your kids have been lying to you. What they use this for is they use this to dig the trenches in the secret wars that they fight behind your back. That is correct. In the backyard, in the front yard, in the road, they'll dig trenches with these things. And if the enemy gets too close in their little trench warfare, they will take them and they will, they will kill a kid and not even blink. Disgusting. Some of you parents who actually care about the welfare of your child may be wondering, if I can't use any of this stuff, then what can I let my child have as a toy? Well, 
I will show you. I will tell you the first thing that you can let your child use as an alternative to these violent weapons. Standard dog food. Not only is it colorful and fun to throw, it is a good edible treat for your children. <coughs> edible, fun treat, fun treat, fun treat, fun, fun treat. You should let them eat it all the time. It's Alternative number two, common house plant. What are you supposed to do with this? It, it's a toy. You play with it. You know, it, oh, if it's an aloe plant, you can tear off an end oh, and you can inhale the juicy insides to provide a sort of age reversal ointment to yourself. Mmm, feel younger already. That'll do it for this video. I'm glad to have shown you the truth behind what your kids are really doing when they are playing sports outside. Well, seeing that my job is done, I will now bid you adieu and put this knowledge to good use. Thank you.